first ace, who's been sensationally backed. Just about set. Run to the winning post and two to complete. There's a green light. Arms folding back and away they go and along the inside Birdie Francis got away well. Tullerhurst Ace going with it now and Birdie will take the set. Moving up on the outside is Postal Express fills third spot in the breeze. Over on the inside next out Pepper Jack from Reno Shannon. Along the inside next as they make their way into the uh, back is the Innocent One. Second last in the race Spanish Luster and last of all is Chingy. Now they're about to make their way into the back straight and uh, getting to the lead was Tullerhurst Ace for Nathan Hurst and Birdie Francis gets the set. They've got about eight or nine metres then to the good of Postal Express. Another six or seven metres away to our Pepper Jack. Reno Shannon just being restrained. Getting underneath it was the Innocent One. Spanish Lustre back to second last. And Chingy last of all. In fact, they're in Indian file. As they race down the back straight, they're about to go by the lead time. It's running 48.1. And in front is Tullerhurst Ace. Bertie Francis second, third Postal Express. And fourth is our Pepper Jack. Fifth over on the inside, still the Innocent One from Reno. Reno Shannon. Now Spanish Lustre breaks the peg line, goes moving up now on the outside and Chingy gets onto its back. They're about to get to the top of the home straight. They've got about 13.50 to travel and Tullerhurst Ace in front. Birdie Francis having a nice run behind the leader. Postal Express three back the pegs and four back the pegs out. Pepper Jack. Moving up on the outside is Spanish Lustre. Chingy onto its back. Reno Shannon gets onto their back and last of all on the inside is the Innocent One. They ran the first quarter in 30.9. They go by the winning post. They're about to run out of the straight, short of a lap to travel. Tullerhurst Ace in front and Nathan Hurst takes a look around. In second spot now Spanish Lustre moving up on the outside. In third is Birdie Francis on the outside. Chingy from Postal Express. Reno Shannon out Pepper Jack who's racing second last and last of all is the Innocent One. They go by the second quarter in 31 and 2. It's a 62 half down the back and out in front still Tullerhurst Ace. Two metres over the stable mate Spanish Luster. Birdie Francis sweating on an inside run. Chingy's on the outside one by one from Postal Express and then came Reno Shannon out Pepper Jack and still last of all is the Innocent One. They about to race off the back. They got 500 to go. In front still Tullerhurst Ace. Spanish Luster on the outside edging a little bit closer. Chingy hooks out three wide commences it run, its run and then Birdie Francis behind those runners next along the inside out Pepper Jack. The Innocent One's going to be the widest of all and then came behind them this Postal Express and Reno Shannon caught last they bunch turning for home Tullerhurst Ace in front Birdie's going for an inside run Postal Express from a fair way back and Spanish Luster in the centre Tullerhurst Ace in front Birdie Francis Postal Express down the outside and Spanish Luster still kicking they go to the line close Maybe all the way Tullerhurst Ace, but hang on to your tickets. A good go for the Miners as well. We've got Postal Express and then also their Spanish Luster. On the inside was Birdie Francis, not out of it. Uh, behind them there also missing out now would have been our Pepper Jack from Chingy. Uh, also missing out the Innocent One and Reno Shannon, one of the last ones in. I'd lean towards Tullerhurst